In this video, I'm going to be explaining the basics of how I like to format my SQL statements in order to keep them readable and understandable at a glance. Now, on the screen right now, I have a sample query that I've written against the AdventureWorks sample dataset. And you can see right off the bat that it's broken down into the key sections of it. I like to start with my keywords fully aligned to the left and every line inside them one level of indentation to the right. This allows you to quickly see where the different sections are and also allows you to gauge the relative complexity of them at a glance. I can see that I'm going to be using two fields. I'm going to be using four tables. There are going to be two um, filter predicates involved, a single group by clause, a single having clause, and it's going to be ordered by a single field. So with the specific parts in there, in something like a select statement, I'm going to have every uh, second and onward field started by a comma. Allows you to quickly comment them out if necessary. In my field selection or from clause, I like to have every table that's going to be added to it on a separate line so I can quickly glance and see four lines, going to be using four tables. Same thing for my where clause. Each line that starts one level of indent in is going to be a new uh, filter predicate and so on and so forth. So I can quickly see when I'm looking at this the complexity of the query. It makes it really easy to understand, really easy to find certain things and modify certain things. Just as a comparison, if I take the same query and I remove most of the spacing and indentation, it becomes a lot harder to read. And this still isn't as bad as I've seen. I'm starting all the keywords on the new sign. I really just got rid of all of the additional white space. So that's the basics of it. There are some other tricks and tips that I might get into in later videos as far as how to enhance things even further, but that's a good coverage of the basics.